It's Riyad Mahrez! He's in, and that cuts the most brilliant second. I think, like Jack said, we I think we played... We played good in the first half we had the ball they didn't have anything apart from the from the two goals we conceded so when we come back we was a bit frustrated at half time but the manager spoke to us and then we knew and we've done it before that we can come back from two or one one or two goals uh, behind and that's what we did i think we played so good second half uh, we showed what, what what we are and uh, a bit of luck as well but we provoked the luck and we deserve the win. Jack, I see you smile. Something of that. It's Mares. 2-0 to Leicester City. A start. Welcome to my channel, the DZ Phoenix, where I always talk about the Algerian national team and their players. I realize it's been a long time since I haven't made any new content. It's been like two months, but I was extremely busy. I have a lot of things to work out. But now I'm back and excited to make much, much more content, inshallah. Anyways, we have to talk about Riyad Mahrez. Riyad Mahrez, what a player. Really, in my opinion, is a key player for Man City. While the World Cup was going on, I feel like he did put in a lot of work. But to be honest, Mahrez, his qualities are always in lately there. They never really, truly disappear. And plus, he hasn't really started all the games anyway. 14 games, only 8 of which he started. He had 5 goals in the past 5 matches. 3 of them were against Chelsea. He totally owns Chelsea. And it's clear to see that when Guardiola puts him on the bench, putting him on, starting him, clearly, clearly makes a difference. I feel like it really imitates the Mahrez that we've seen in the past. Brilliant vision, brilliant technique. All four goals were involved from Mahrez. A key assist to key pass, I mean, to Alvarez. A headed assist to Holland. He doesn't usually do assists that way or even scores with his head that often, but that's really cool that Mahrez did that. And it was a brilliant header from Holland, of course. Nice goal to the far post, the far corner. Uh, just the way he tricks players, the way he maneuvers around them is something most players cannot do. People will still most likely talk about other players like Alvarez or Holland or Foden being more uh, benef beneficial to Man City, but honestly, I would put Mahrez's impact as, maybe as high as Yaya, Yaya Torres because Man City, for instance, never went to the final and Mahrez was the one to take them there. Obviously, when you're an Algerian and not a Brazilian or Argentinian or a British player, you won't be as highly regarded. But fans realize how important and how essential he is to the team. This player started from a fifth division team. He was Sahsad. He went all the way up to Man City. People mocked him, saying he was too weak, that he could never ever go in a high high team. But if some, if you really have ambition, it doesn't really matter what anyone else says. You have to have confidence in yourself uh, in any aspect of your life. He won the Premier League four times. He, he was an African champion, uh, PFA player of the year, uh, Algerian Ballon d'Or winner. He placed many times Ballon d'Or, 7th place, 10th place. He does really, really well and hopefully he'll get better and better this season. And I feel like he really has his place now in Manchester City in the Premier League and is, in my opinion, top of three. Um, one of the top three players in the world and for me he's always gonna be number one maybe I'm a bit biased but there isn't that many players like him at all I just have to put it in Zidane talking about Mahrez and when Zidane says something about Mahrez you have to Zidane Mahrez le gusta como jugador que opina de su calidades Sí, sí, sí es muy bueno es muy bueno y además es un jugador eh 
eh, diferente es un jugador muy bueno técnicamente que, que, que siempre es un jugador vertical que, 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 que punta siempre a la portería y es rápido con el balón sobre todo con el balón eh, nada eh, tú me preguntas yo te contesto eso pero al final eh, no es un jugador mío entonces aparte de decir our country so much and there's a, a, a video that hasn't really been promoted that much that he did like a year ago um, about his choice about Algeria, how it makes him feel and all of that. I received the most grand value, you know, with my father. We went all the time there. And you feel really directly this contact. You feel that it's like an element, you know, when you arrive to the Bled. Tu sens que c'est ton, c est, c est, c est, ça fait partie de toi, tu vois. Et ça m'a ça toujours suivi, tu vois. Et, 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 et bon, mon père n'est plus là maintenant, mais je sais qu'il est, il est, il est heureux de, de, de voir que, voilà, le bled, nous, et tout le monde dit, ouais, l'Algérie, c'est tous fierté, nerveux, tout ça. Mais franchement, les Algériens, est, sont, sont, on est tous attachants, tu vois. C'est vraiment un pays magnifique et. et Et voilà, c'est des choses qui, quand je porte le maillot de l'équipe nationale, tu ressens cette fierté et tu repenses à quand tu étais jeune et tu venais avec ton père, ta famille, tu passais deux mois là-bas avec, euh, avec toute ta famille qui, qui vit dans un village, tu vois. Et, et, et voilà, tu repenses à tout ça et c'est pour ça que tu te bats, tu vois. Et, et même quand tu arrives, hein, quand tu gagnes la Coupe d'Afrique et tu vois tout ce monde, tout cette, euh, toute cette cette joie et tout ça, tu, tu ne peux que te battre pour ce, pour ce drapeau, tu vois. 181 goals, 71 Man City so far since 2018, Leicester City 48 goals, Le Havre 10 goals, Le Havre B, Le Havre B 24 goals, Algeria 28 goals, in total 181 goals, really, really an amazing player. Rabbi Hafto, inshallah. Inshallah, he'll be on fire with Algeria as well, which I'm sure of. Anyway, he made a recent comeback. Anyways, um, that's it for my video. I really wanted to touch on Red Mahrez. Haven't talked to him about him in a while. Haven't talked in general in this channel in a while, but you can look forward to more of my content and many more videos to come, inshallah. See you next time. Thank you.